You heard it right, mother. I'm fighting Mike Tyson. Jake Paul was a Mike Tyson is what? And you have to be kidding me. Right? I I thought I wanted this fight and now that is out. Ooh, look, I'm on focus. Come here. So and today today's talk show will be me and my little buddy talk here. So come here. Mike Tyson vs. Jake Paul is set and I'm like, what? Really? But I checked it and it's true. <sighs> so let's dissect it. First of all, I think let's make this clear. My opinion on this is this is bullshit. I mean, let's start point number one. So Jake used, used to fight fighters that are at least 20 years older than him. Everybody knows that. Uh, and my opinion on that is he's uh, scared that if he fights uh, a normal boxer, professional boxer, that is like something like 12 and 2, I don't know, something like that, nobody will watch his fights uh, of him getting his ass whooped, ass whooped by a normal boxer like uh the only time he fought someone that is his age and he is a boxer was uh tommy fury and tommy fury won against him in a decision he could not know a normal 20 something year old fighter so that says a lot i mean yeah and the he has fought basketballs, uh, he has fought MMA guys, most of which have never stepped in a boxing ring. They're used to wrestling, kicking, and it's a lot of different guys. I mean, I transitioned from boxing to MMA and I realized how different the two sports are. And look, he's a fighter as well. Knockout. So, uh, what can I say? Uh, it's a little bit strange, like Mike, like why? Despite them, I was going to rip his heart out. I'm the best ever. I'm the most brutal and vicious and most ruthless champion there's ever been. I mean, you have money. I don't think you need any money. Like, you have the Tyson Ranch, you have all these promotions of different things. You have the Tyson merch. I mean, I don't think you're struggling. And now, as a 60-year-old man, uh, with a wife and kids and family and everything going on and you decide to go in an exhibition match. That feels strange, strange and sussy. And I came to a conclusion and hearing some other people talk about it that this is an exhibition. Of course, they are not going to risk Mike's legacy, right? Of getting knocked out by Jake, or oh, they're not go going to risk Jake being knocked out by 60 year old man, even though it's Mike Tyson. And I came to the conclusion that they're doing that just for the payday, just for the tickets that they're going to sell. Here's your check, SpongeBob. Money, 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 money. And just take the money. An exhibition is another way to, s to say that it will be more entertainment then a real fight, uh, they're going to do a friendly sparring. The thing that is not said, they're going to do a friendly sparring. Uh, they're going to protect each other and not, not trying to knock each other out like in a real fight. And uh, at the end, they're probably are going to vote a split decision like they did with the Roy Jones fight. And that's it, everybody slap their hands and go their way with, I don't know, 10 million bucks in each person's pocket. So it's uh, in this regard, it's a win-win for both. But uh, otherwise, it's uh, pure entertainment. It, it will be a joke, like Jake Paul is a joke to 
to be honest. He only fights old men, old people. And like my best and in the whole situation it will be a lose lose for Jake. If it was a normal fight and if he manages to beat Mike Tyson, even though it's Mike Tyson, he's 60 years old and he's way slower, he hasn't trained as much because when you're a fighter you train every day. I mean at least you train six times a week, one day you do active rest. That's how I did it. When I was a fighter, imagine Mike Tyson's workout, like thousand uh, dips or whatever he was doing in his prime. So, I mean, he's not even slightly training as a fighter. He will train those four, five months leading up to this fight and that's it. And uh, if he knocks out Mike Tyson, he will be said, oh, you're beating an elderly person, like, and they will protect Mike and whatever, even though Mike agreed to this fight. And if Mike Tyson uh, still has it in him and has the knockout power and manages to knock out Jake Paul, uh, then the whole world will laugh at him for pretending to be the biggest fighter in the world and getting knocked down by 60-year-old Mike Tyson, even though it's Mike Tyson, still 60 years of age is not a small number. And Mike Tyson looks good, Mike Tyson looks good. For this year, I haven't seen a person in, in their 60s looking as good as Mike, but imagine all those years of being a beast will do something to you like this. And Overall, I think it will be a joke and I think it will be an entertainment mode and it will be a fight. Let me know what you think about this fight and down in the comment section, but I will watch it. I'm not going to lie, I will watch it because I like entertainment and it's Mike Tyson. It's my personal, my favorite boxer leading up to my uh, boxing amateur career. Uh, I was obsessed with Mike Tyson. They even called me Little Tyson in my city. I don't know why they did that. It just came out as a nickname because uh, my boxing style was way more different than Mike Tyson's. And I am a taller person, taller boxer. He's a short one doing the slips, uppercuts and hooks. And I was like more, more Muhammad Ali style. No. Let's say uh, it was a combination between Mohamed Ali and maybe Tyson Fury, something like that. Jab, jab, you know, like this. But otherwise, uh, what can I say? Yeah, probably the, the conclusion all in all is they do it for the money and for the entertainment because J this is all Jake Paul does, entertain trying to be entertaining, most of his fights are full bullshit like fighting against a basketball player or someone that I have not have never heard before and he win or he knocks him out or whatever and like okay who cares brother and that's why he uh, was calling Mike Tyson for 3 years I think since the Roy Jones fight it was oh calling Mike Tyson I will knock, my I will knock out Mike Tyson and now you're doing an exhibition and uh, you won't knock him because it will be into the agreement that you will do a friendly sparring like I'm doing here with my boy Tom. Toop, 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 toop. And that's it. Throw a little punches, uh, have a little boost, uh, cheek or whatever and take 10 million and the line. So I hope you enjoy this uh, dissection, my dissection of the fight that is coming up. And let me know what you think down in the comment section if you think it will be a real fight and who will win. And yeah, let's get it.